What's going on guys? It's your boy Fox back in the house with another reaction for Unordinary Episode 171 Chapter 1 who cares? At the end of last chapter, it was pretty much Aizen talking smack to Black about uh, him not wearing socks to sleep, even though in reality, Black went out, kicked some uh, bad guy uh, booty, and you know went home and went to sleep sleep. Meanwhile, um, y'all brought this up to me in the uh, comments last time, but uh, I think the guy that was watching uh, that was watching Black as he was changing and leaving and all that like a pervert uh, was uh, Kyo. Uh, Ray's uh, best friend, well, Ray's former best friend before he took over the school and he passed away and all that, um, was watching him. I think so too, but I mean, it, it, it well, let's see, what's this, what's going on? Anywho, we're back at the school. I'm surprised you're even up, dog. I'd be like, I'm skipping school altogether. I'm staying sleep, sleep, you feel me? <laughs> Last night in New Side. He went Super Saiyan 3. <laughs> I actually managed to pull that off. It don't get cocky, sir. <laughs> yeah, he's like, yeah. Yeah, I'm proud of myself. Jumping straight into the chapter. Infirmary. Hmm, it doesn't seem too bad. Eh, yeah. I mean, it's noticeable, but that right there can be healed up rather quickly by the doc. It's a pretty dark bruise, but nothing serious. Huh? Really? That's weird. Last night, last night I was feeling really weak and couldn't stop coughing. But when I woke up this morning, I felt fine. Mmm, that's weird. Here, drink this. Thanks, Doc. From now on, maybe try talking your issues out with Aizen instead of fighting. He thinks Aizen did it? I think could if he locked on to you and you weren't paying attention. You know, I know you kids love to blow, blow each other up, but I've got enough on my plate. Uh, yeah. Sorry, it won't happen again. Yeah, right. <laughs> Press room. What? What is the news today? Breaking news: Joker struck again. Huh? Uh oh. Oh, Sarah. Seraphina. What brings you here? Did you need something? Aizen? What do you know about John? <laughs> uh, not a thing, madam. I uh, Who is John again? I, I completely forgot who this person is. Sorry. I have no idea who that is. Exactly. I have no idea who that is. Punch him in the face. <laughs> you don't need to hide it anymore. I already know John is Joker. Arlo told me. Really? Yeah, I need to have a talk with John about all this. But first I want to clear the picture up of everything he's done till now. So I'll take what I'll take whatever information you have on him. I'm like give no you need to clarify. Give me the truth. Don't sugarcoat it. Don't don't try to twist it and contort it in the way that you want to spin it. Just tell me what it is. Give me the car facts. That's what I want. The girls don't Oh, so he actually gave a papers papers. Yep, and there goes that boy. Average student does not get along with others, does not like to participate in class, blah, blah, blah. We have written all that before. 7.0 ability. Ability level by year two. Just like me. But John wasn't always this strong. According to uh, these files, he started off as a cripple. John was a troubled kid back then. To put it simply, he had a hard time dealing with a certain reality. There's no doubt that he was picked on picked on when he was younger. He built up a ton of uh, resentment toward the toward those who were stronger than him. And like the uh, the students who attacked me when I first lost my ability. Like the group who ad who abducted me, abducted me. Like all the fake jokers. John always wanted the chance to retaliate. Now hold on, wait a minute now. 
I need to get back on discussion videos. I actually missed them. He didn't want a chance to retaliate. Well, he got his wish. He shot from he shot from being a cripple to being the most powerful kid in the re in his region. If I if I had an opportunity to fight back back, I would. Because being because being able to take down people who were stronger than me would be satisfying. Oh, I forgot that conversation. You can't remember that. Yeah. John indulged in his newfound power. Exacted revenge on those who wronged him and very quickly rose to become king. But somewhere along uh, the way, he lost himself, which led his entire class to turn on him. Warnings of aggression and violent uh, behavior. On top of that, notes with specific directions on how to deal with him. Even the staff of New Boston High School had trouble keeping up with him. I tried everything I could to stop him, but nothing worked. He's unhinged. His re he's revenge-driven and utterly uncontrollable. Had you left him alone? His records are consistent with everything Arlo said. John was a reckless high tier. Yes, but you gotta realize that that's why. <laughs> Then you gotta realize that's why he pretended to be a cripple the whole time until up until these recent points. After hospitalizing his classmates, John was finally expelled from New Boston. That was around the time On Ordinary was published. I see. So On Ordinary was William's way of teaching John to use his powers responsibly. John re uh, reread it often and managed to. Its message definitely meant a lot to him. Yeah, now you're putting it, girl, you're putting it together. All the stuff he used to preach to me about. The stronger person is always right, you know. I don't think... I don't think he was faking it. We should be using our powers to bring balance and peace. He meant everything he said. Yes! 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 I really admired the, uh... The hero of an ordinary. He listened to others and realized everyone's and realize everyone has something valuable to offer. Yes! Yes, I'm getting in my feels! I feel things! He regretted his previous actions. So he tried to change. Yes, but something still doesn't make sense. Yes! For some reason, John transferred to Wellston with a crippled persona. Why? After what happened at New Boston, he no longer wanted a part, wanted part in the hierarchy. I get that. But wouldn't it have been better to become a mid-tier instead? Huh. You know, it is a good question. Huh. I want to make a video about that now. Yeah, I, I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get a collab on that one. Then nobody would have paid attention to him, and he'd have no problem blending in. He could have easily lived an average life. So why did he choose to be? choose to be completely powerless. Why go to that extreme? Because John doesn't have a middle ground, dude. He's, he's one extreme to the other, which I, I understand because that's me. I don't have a middle ground really either. No matter how I look at it, it's a bad idea. Well, you know he's not the smartest person in the world. By acting as a cripple, John put himself in the same situation he was in before. Just like before, uh, just like before students picked on him because he was weak. Just like before, he wasn't able to defend himself or any of his friends. And just like before, he couldn't handle the pain of being a cripple. And so he relapsed. And there we get our boy now. No, he hasn't realized that Serafina talked some sense into the man. <laughs> Go save him from himself. <laughs> John, haven't you realized you're repeating the same mistakes? Well, you know, insanity is the process of repeating something and expecting a different outcome. That is insanity. And he's probably calling again. Oh no, Roland? What's Roland want? Hey Roland, Serafina, can you come to the infirmary? I don't like where this is going. Uh, why? What happened? No, please. No, not Evie. Evie, she's unconscious. Stop! Stop! 
Cactus. Joker attacked her. Oh no. No. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. 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 What are you doing? You don't. You don't know what you're doing. Oh. Oh no. Or it's or a sensei. Please. But all right, guys. No, I'm really hurt by this. I'm not. I'm, I'm not friend. Like I'm hurt. Like, that, that, that ending. Like first off, Evie is unconscious. She was attacked by Joker. And then the fact that we just got this, and Serafina was finally starting to put the pieces together like a jigsaw puzzle. And, and then we get this. And now it's all about to get blown up. I'm. I'm. I'm pressed. Um, I like what Serafina said. Why didn't he just pose as a mid tier? That, that. That's definitely a video. It's definitely a video. I don't. I don't know. Oh wait. Before I get off, I haven't meant to tell you. So, this is completely unrelated to Unordinary or anything. But, this Friday, I will be streaming on Twitch. I will be streaming around 7 p.m. That is uh, it's Central Standard Time. That is my what I'm on. I don't know what that translate in, what that translate into whatever time zone you stay in. But, if you stay in my area, or I know if you stay in Chicago... Uh, Central Standard Time, 7 p.m. I will be streaming uh, Neo 2. Uh, and the reason I'm streaming it is because I said on my Discord, if you're not in my Discord, you should definitely go check that out. It's a lot of fun. But in my Discord, I said that I would allow all of my subs via uh, Twitch, via YouTube, via uh, Discord. I would allow y'all to choose what gender... Uh, character I play as in Neo 2 because there is character customization and all that I would allow y'all to pick the gender and I would allow y'all to pick the looks and the name and after all that's said and done I will come up with a backstory or a lore um so yeah so if you want to be there for that uh just go down in the description below the link to my twitch is always there hit the uh follow button so when I go live you know so yeah 7 p.m Friday night, 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. I'll be going live. If you want to, and if you and if you want to uh, pick which gender it is beforehand, you just let me know because I'm going with the uh, with the overwhelming majority. If you want me to play as a male, put hashtag samurai, and if you want me to play as a female, put hashtag kunoichi. But you know that's that's really all I wanted to say, guys. This chapter got me in my feels. Definitely tune in for the. Uh, for the live stream Friday for Neo 2. It will be the first Let's Play that I do on the channel after the live stream is done. But 